like a motherfucker. New flock got a dozen of them. This dinosaur is awesome. Another two games on to go. I'm driving back from uh, dropping Christy off, and I thought to myself, it's time to talk to my gamers. It's time to tell them what's up in the world. <laughs> what I'm going through, Dad's still very sick, having a rough time. Halloween on its way. We're going ahead and we're going to make Devin a zombie. Good, dude. Here. All right, when you, when you get up and well, you stand grandma, up. Grandma, you might mess it up. No, just, I'll just touch it. <laughs> Okay, good stop running. Yeah, you're good. Alright. Yes! It totally looks like zombies. Like a zombie bus. Yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. Here, right, turn, turn. Let me see. Oh my gosh, that is so realistic. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, that's dripping down his eye. Oh god, oh god, is it? Here, here, here. Here, my god. He's always gonna be Bambi. She's way too cute to be a deer right now. She's gonna have a lot of people hunting her down. I know her boyfriend's gonna be a hunter, and I'm like, I'm not cool with that association. I don't like, uh, I don't like what's going on there at all. Oh, well now I get it. She's <laughs> She's not dead. She's yeah, I did. Oh, good, good. That's perfect. <laughs> That's perfect. And he's laughing, Zoe. Oh, just so you know. <laughs> That's perfect. Time to fire up the grill for uh, Halloween here. My uh, daughter's boyfriend is a meatitarian. Doesn't need any vegetables, so highly, highly endorse that. Actually, I don't like that. Don't be a hunter. Stay away from my little deer. Stay away. Let's just light this baby up and get a little bit of that fire. Yeah, fire. You know, it's really hard to stay on track. It's really hard to go down the road of life and stay focused on one thing, on a goal. How many of you out there have like goals that you set for yourselves and then you like get off track or have a real hard time real focusing on it, you know? Where am I? I don't know. I have no idea. I've always had this one goal in my mind is making this channel for everybody and growing it so that we can all have a good time together as a community, but it's goddamn hard. It's really hard. Can you do a zombie first? Like this. <laughs> <laughs> Do a zombie first. Uh. Sometimes it's very hard. Like, you know, even though I have everybody and I know you guys are all pitching in, sometimes I feel like, you know, I just don't have enough support to do what I need to do, what I want to do, the, the dream of entertaining all you guys. Jeez, Move it. What are you doing? Move it. I can't. Yeah. There can't be double phone action. Double phone action. Double phone action. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm giving you a different perspective. <laughs> Dad is a weirdo. It is a long, hard road. And, you know, that's what I'm trying to tell people in life. You're going to have long, hard roads. And you're going to have times when you just don't know where to go. Sometimes you want to take a turn off, and that's okay. Sometimes you want to make a left turn or a right turn. You say to yourself, I can't do it anymore. I'm done. I just found it, and I was like, cool. I'm going to experience it. And sometimes that's what you got to do on a road. Take a left turn, take a right turn, and find yourself somewhere completely different that's fine too but don't give up don't give up if you really like it I guess that's what I'm trying to say don't give up and that's cool you might feel disoriented like you made a wrong decision maybe but maybe this is the best decision of your life you don't know no matter the road Keep on persevering. Don't give up. If you find yourself in an area you're not familiar with, I don't know where I'm at actually. I really don't. I found this place and I'm like, hey, cool. I'm going to experience it. There's there's a cool little river. It's like a river, a pond over here. There's like a dirt road I've been walking down for at least a mile or so. Just found a driving home. I'm like, hey, cool, let's walk it. Let's do it. You always find your way back somehow. Spooky Halloween vibe. Yeah, okay, creepy. Here. Here. I'm not sure who this is, but. 
Michelle's in my ear. You're a weirdo. What do you do, dude? He's a totem zombie. Now I get why you didn't get down with <laughs> Yeah. Pop in. This is why I didn't want to go in. with you. I will later. Right. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of pizza. <laughs> you need help from people. You can't do it on your own a lot of the times. And a lot of people, they'll just focus on the fact that they, they do it on their own. And that, that's draining. That drains you. That's not a good way to go about it. That's why it's nice to have you guys, and I can remind myself, like, hey, I got my gamers, yo. They got my back, and we're gonna do it. Come on, dog.